Happily married men. How many serious partners did you have before settling down? Hi. All first off, congratulations on your happy marriage. Secondly, how many real deal? Committed. I think they might be the one relationships did you have to go through before meeting your actual one? Any details are much appreciated. What they were like. If you regret the experience. How you powered through the heartbreak. What led you to eventually finding happiness? How old you were when you met your spouse? Etc. I'm currently reeling from the end of my first serious relationship and could use a good reminder that not all of us actually wind up with our first love. Too serious. One I genuinely thought was the one before I recognized she was emotionally manipulative and abusive. My wife is the best she's so rad. I know within a couple weeks that I was done looking. None. Wifey is it. We just celebrated our 45th wedding anniversary this past Sunday. Wifey and I met and married while serving in the Marine Corps. We met on the 1st of July 1977 and started as workout buddies. We went on our first date on the 3rd of September. By our third date, I knew I was a goner. I was 22 and she was 20. We married 15 months and one week from the day we met. None for me. I knew she was it for me. First serious one. We've had plenty of ups and downs, but stuck with each other. Glad it worked lol. Just the one I married, I'm boring I know. Just one. She turned out to be faking her personality for the first six months. We dated a year after that and then split. I think the following is as serious as things got outside of casual relationships. Regular girlfriends and whatever I was friends with a girl for a while before we started hooking up and I fell in love with her then she broke my heart. And I was friends with another girl for a long time and we were a will they won't they item for about six years. Eventually I got tired of waiting. As far as really serious marriage is on the table relationship my wife was the first one. I had about five serious relationships. And many many dates. I cared too much about them being hot. And most of the women I chose were very selfish. I found one that was not that way. One I actually enjoyed spending time with. I married her. Best decision of my life. She is a great wife and mother. My exes would have divorced me and taken my kids 100 lol. I was a whore in my younger days. One real relationship before my wife and I now. Was probably about as tragic an ending as a relationship could have had and I swore off love and. Romance when we fell apart. Ended up casually dating my best friend from when I was 19 when we were both tail end of our 20s. Both of us out of painful divorces. Best decision we ever made after a decade together. Two kids and a marriage. Later. None. Met my wife in 88, she was my first for everything. 2. The high school sweetheart and then the college sweetheart. Dodged two bullets and found the love of my life in med school. Third time is truly the charm. More than I wanted to. Finding the right person is so hard. 0. I am one of the very fortunate few that met my wife when young. Dated for 10 years and now married for 19 years and counting. 2 long terms 1. The high school seat hearts and tinder ones docent count. Those two were the only ones I hoped to settle with till I found out they're not it. Before my current relationship lived together engaged to be married in January. Had one other serious live together relationship a lot of non-serious dating and hookups. The serious one didn't work out. I left. And I didn't date much for a while after. And then there was a time period when I was ready I went crazy with hookups to get over it. I settled down and had less frequent hookups. One of those hookups stuck that's my fiancé. 3. One in college, one in my mid-twenties, one in my early thirties. 
All about three-year relationships. I am my husband's second serious, but altogether third girlfriend. The first one was teenage stuff. Lasted three weeks. The second one was an emotionally abusive one. Lasted three years. We have been together for four. Married this year. Married 44 years. She was smart, good looking and frugal. I said that one is for me went to marriage counseling once after the kids left home because we were arguing more it was like getting your car tuned up fantastic. We have nothing in common. She is academic. Me athletic. She does her own thing a lot. I do my own thing a lot. Seems to work. We don't cheat. Second GF before I found her blind date. I had one. We were planning our wedding. Wondering what we should do. When the day before the wedding she was murdered by her ex. I will never forget that beautiful smile she had. It had filled the room with light. I will always remember when she wanted to have kids. She will be missed. None. I fell in love with her the first time I met her in ninth grade English class. We were married 37 years. I dated a lot before finding my wife. I had three serious relationships at the age it would have made sense to propose. None of them came close though. We had good relationships, but never entered the this should be forever phase. My wife and I started dating, and almost instantly entered that phase. We moved in together after six months, and I bought a ring around eight. Proposed on our one year anniversary. It was like Edison. I found a bunch of ways not to invent a light bulb. As soon as I found it though, it was obvious. Almost one. I thought she was the one. And she thought the same about me. But the relationship we wanted never really got off the ground. Zero serious she might be the one. Four semi-serious things seem to be going well. A healthy amount of flings. I think two three serious partners before being married is a good idea. It really depends on level of maturity as well. One and a half. First I didn't know better. Second I caught the red flags. Third is perfection. The most amazing woman I've ever met and she's absolutely drop dead gorgeous inside and out. I did go through about 50 or so casual encounters all up to find this one. I once married and had a 10 year relationship before meeting my late wife. I dated some between those relationships before my late wife became my everything. People tend to rush into relationships and I learned not to do that. You have to meet a variety of people in your life to understand what you value and want in life. I had zero. Married at 30 and spent all of my 20s just hooking up. There was one I saw off and on for over a year but we were never exclusive. Surely you can't be serious. 2. First one was my first but her parents moved and we lost contact for years finally met her again. But had no feelings for her after. Second was wonderful but I was in the military and got orders overseas so we broke up. Last I heard she was married. 3. Depending on how you count them. I dated a girl from 1719. I dated a girl from 1921. I dated a girl from 2224. I regret letting this one go as long as I did. I met my wife at 25. There were a bunch of shorter relationships and one-offs in there. As well as some recurring long-term FWBs. I learned a lot from all of the girls I was with. If I knew what I know now, I wouldn't have stayed in most of the long-term relationships as long and just had more fun. But I needed to be in those relationships to learn what a bad relationship was and what red flags to look for. I've been with my wife for 12 years now. Married almost 9. 4 serious beyond 1 year long and 2 FWBs. Probably a dozen or so random hookups. Married at 30 years old. Very happily married still well into my 40s. Relationships are trial and error. Learn from each one.